Hey guys, how y'all doing? I'm here to give you guys a recap of the new episode of Berserk, which is on episode 10. Now, last week's ep last week's episode was a 9.5 apparently, and it's like a freaking recap or whatever the heck what happened throughout the last the last previous episode. So that's the reason why the recap of Berserk of 2017 didn't come up today. I mean, last last week, but today the new episode came out, which is cool and all. However, there's still some things that I'm not too happy about. So if anything else. Let's go. We have to with that. The first 15 minutes, of course, is just a major fight next to the tree whatsoever. And of course, but of course, Guts in a Berserker armor ends up clashing against Grunbold. And apparently he managed to push him back, shatter his shield, and destroy his shield with this fake cannon with this cannon arm. Well, that's the fake arm. And after that. We had to it that Grunbald was trying to like him hit Guts with his hammer, but Guts managed to stop it with his giant sword and managed to do a major major cut slice on Grunbald's shoulder. And Grunbald has no choice but to transform into a dragon apostle. And we have to it that Shuke ends up explaining to Ishiduro about how the armor berserker armor works. Because apparently Guts on the other hand does not feel any pain and because of that he's able to use all of his strength and all of his strength, but at the same time, he does not realize he is actually destroying his own body. And when all of this is happening right now, we have to it that Guts did have a couple broken bones. Well, one on the leg and then another one that a uh, certain apostle hit Guts on because they want to join in in the fight. But Guts, but the armor ends up healing Guts' broken bones and it was actually helping him out. But at the same time, it was actually risky because... They're digging right into his flesh and skin, and blood is spurting out like, a, like a fountain, etc. And we are seeing the blood, in the blood of that in the berserk, in in the berserker armor in this episode. Before the fight could get any further and cause any more mischief, we have to it that Shuke managed to enter Guts's mind and psyche, and managed to drag him out of there. And beforehand, Guts managed to managed to get himself in control, and with the help of Shuke's master, etc. After Guts saves Serpico, Isidro, and Casca from the Apostles, they end up managing to escape thanks to Shuki's master. But after that, we have to it that somewhere else at another place, which I think like um, a Kushan place, um, we have some people trying to figure out certain information about what's going on. But with the help, but and they almost gotten k eaten or killed by a half-human and half-beast Apostle by Kushan magic, I believe. And we have to it that some of the Hawks Warriors, which I'm pretty sure you all know what I'm talking about when I'm talking about Hawks Warriors, manage to come in and save them. And they tell them to run and hide for now, while a Hawk will bring a powerful storm to, to, to help all you guys out. Then the episode ends up with Guts' party being at a beach and Guts is smiling because like I'm seeing Casca like um being happy and having a smile. He didn't expect to see that again. Of course, that happened after the credits, so you could call it a post-credit scene, etc. So the next episode, it looks like um, another like um, thing called a pro proclaimed omen, whatsoever. Those of you guys who are up to date with the manga or up to date to where the anime is at, which I apparently recommend you reading the manga because there's a lot of things in there that that are missing that became very important. Not to mention like the next episode. Is gonna be more important as we as it follows. And honestly, I am pretty shocked to see that the anime is still continuing on with this, you know? Because there's a lot of things that like um that I'm surprised that seeing the anime is gonna continuing on because next episode preview is called Proclaimed Omens. And I'm pretty sure everybody who are, who is up to date with the Berserk manga or gotten to the certain point in the manga would know where I'm getting at here. So, like I said, the episode's pretty simple, but when it came to the fight between Guts and Grimbold, I really wish it was a little bit longer and it took maybe at least the, I don't know, maybe the entire episode, but maybe I thought too much of it because I thought, I thought Berserk 2017 may only have 12 episodes, but who knows what's really, really bound to happen because, yeah. Until then, I'll see you guys in my next video. So, I'm Alpha Zero, people. Have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time, right? Peace out. Bye-bye.